Before we get into today's topic, I'd just like to say that this video is proudly sponsored by FS Academy, which produced the very best tutorials for Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. And indeed, whether you are a professional pilot or just starting out, there's definitely a training package for you. I've done many of them now, and I really do like how they are from real world pilots and instructors, which give you a very bespoke and very natural way of learning. All the links will be in the description below. I highly recommend that you check them out and it's why they are sponsoring this video today. So next comes World Update 14. That's right, folks. World Update 14 is on short finals for next week and it was announced in their recent developer video. And I'll have that linked in the description below. I highly recommend you watch the whole video. So in short, World Update 14 will be focused on Central and Eastern Europe and will include six countries, including the Czech Republic, Slovakia, Hungary, Bosnia and Croatia, to name just a few. And thank you to Asobo um, for including Croatia, since I will be doing a three-week motorcycle tour next month. I cannot wait for that. But don't worry folks, content will keep flowing as I've got very exciting things to show which has been preloaded into uh, YouTube ready for when I'm away. Anyway, so as we say, we've got new DEM, new satellite imagery, 10 new cities all done with photogrammetry. Uh, those will include Prague, Budapest, Dubrovnik as well as many, many more. There are also 103 new points of interest, including six new airports, which is very exciting. And actually, this is an interesting one. The local legend for this particular update is Airplane Heaven's classic new twin-engine airplane from Czechoslovakia. It is their Iro AE45 and AE145. And actually, I'm quite intrigued by this one since it looks like it will be very nice to fly in VR, especially with that cockpit layout. I think it will have a fantastic... Um, view of the world of Microsoft Flight Simulator. It looks very, very well modelled, I have to say, and uh, I just hope that Aeroplane Heaven has paid particular close attention to the sounds, as sometimes that can be their downfall. Also, as part of the stream, they mentioned Sim Update 13, which is planned to be released in September with a beta around mid August. Probably. Jörg said, <laughs> and will feature a number of enhancements, including stability fixes, as well as enhancements and bug fixes for previous world updates. So I'm hoping and praying that London will receive a very nice update because it does look a bit crap compared to the rest of the photogrammetry of Europe. But either way, I think, you know, MSFS 2020 is still full steam ahead. And I'm looking forward to showcasing World Update 14 next week. Although Melissa said I'm not allowed to look at Croatia since we are going there in real life. I think that's fair enough. <laughs> but that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching as always. Please feel free to subscribe and I'll see you again for more big screen beyond content as well as many other things very soon. Bye bye for now.